Hi there everyone, welcome to another Minecraft tutorial video here on the channel and within this video we're going to be focusing on a very easy x-ray glitch in Minecraft that's actually been in the game for quite some time. So this is only for Java edition, this is not available for Bedrock edition. I have done a video on this before but I wanted to do an updated video um, because I didn't think I explained it that well in my previous tutorial, so I'm hoping to do a better quality tutorial in this video. But um, as I said, this is an x-ray glitch that's been in the game for quite some time. As of this video, it does work in Minecraft 1.20 and Minecraft 1.20.4, so that's the most, the most recent release of Minecraft. And all you need to do to get this to work is uh, two building blocks, two pistons, two slabs of some kind, and two levers. That is it. So the barrier for entry for this glitch is very, very low. And it's quite effective because essentially what this glitch allows you to do is make the blocks see-through directly above your head. So that is what we're going to be doing here. And we're going to get straight into it. And what you're going to want to do, obviously, is go deep underground. And the deeper you go, the better. Because if you go deeper, you're more likely to have cave systems and other things above you that you can actually try and search for or will become highlighted using this glitch. So when you're actually down here, um, you're going to want to make yourself a corridor like this. And the first thing you're going to want to do is this. You're going to want to place down a piston like this with a lever on top and then place a half slab on the bottom half of the piston like so, okay? Now, the next thing you should do is place another block and another piston like so. So uh, this piston should be on the lower block and this one should be on the higher block like so. You then place an, another slab on the top half of the piston, like so. So essentially, these are opposites to each other. And then you place the second lever right here. And that is the setup done. It is insanely easy to do this glitch, right? That is it. And then in order to actually activate the glitch, what you need to do is use the lever that's on the lower piston first. So in this case, I'm going to do this one first and this one afterwards. And if you look directly above you, you should then see the x-ray glitch actually working. So as you can see here, we can now see through the world and we can see all pretty much most of the cave systems that are near our vicinity. So we can see the dripstone cave right here and you can also see all of the mobs as well. And you, I can also see some glow squids using this x-ray technique. So that can also be an indicator that you're nearby a lush cave and other things like that. And if you have exposed ore, like this diamond ore block right here, those will also be visible using this method as well. So I can see some redstone, I can see some gold and so on. So that can also be quite helpful. But another reason you may want to use this glitch is that if you're trying to remove all of the mobs in your vicinity, this is a really useful way to check that there's no mobs spawning in the cave systems under your area. Because if there are any mobs nearby, they will actually appear like day pretty much. They're so easy to spot using this method. So you can check that no mobs are actually spawning. But of course, the main reason is to see all of the cave systems that are actually in your area. And it is dead simple to make. And once you've actually done this, obviously this does work in Survival Minecraft as well. Um, you don't actually suffocate um, when you actually do this, uh, when you're using these half slabs. Um, if I actually get out of this for a moment here and deactivate the machine, if I go to Survival Minecraft, you will see that I do not actually suffocate. So if I place down the slabs back again, we're going to do this one and then this one. So as you can see, we do not have any damage given to the player when we use this x-ray glitch in survival Minecraft. 
Okay, everyone, that's it for this tutorial. Hopefully this has helped you out. It's a really simple procedure to get this X-ray glitch to work in Minecraft. Any type of player can do it. The barrier to entry is really, really low and it's just dead simple. So if this is the sort of thing you want to do, then by all means, try it out in your Minecraft world. I will reiterate that this is only for Java edition and Bedrock will not have this glitch, unfortunately. But um, if you did find this video useful, then a like, subscribe on the video would be very much appreciated. And make sure that you hit the notification bell to stay notified of any future videos here on the channel. I hope to do some more tutorials soon before the Christmas break. I will be off for Christmas soon, but I hope to do some more videos. And yeah, hopefully you guys have a nice day. If you want to check out my socials, they're on screen or in the description. But um, hope you all have a nice day. Uh, stay happy and healthy as always. And bye bye.